With Adil Bihari Vajpayee's demise, Japan lost a good friend, PM Shinzo Abe. With Adil Bihari Vajpayee's demise, Japan lost a good friend, PM Shinzo Abe. Shinzo Abe described Vajpayee as a good friend of Japan in his condolence message. Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe has said that with the passing away of former Indian Prime Minister Adil Bihari Vajpayee, his country has lost a good friend. The Japanese leader said this on Friday in his condolence message in which he described Vajpayee as a true statesman and hailed his contributions to the friendships between the two countries. I am deeply saddened to learn the demise of former Prime Minister Adil Bihari Vajpayee, Abe said in a message, which was shared by External Affairs Ministry spokesperson Ravesh Kumar on Twitter. Remembering Vajpayee's visit to Japan in 2001, Abe said, On behalf of the government and people of Japan, I would like to convey my sincerest condolences to the government and people of India and the bereaved family. His Excellency Vajpayee visited Japan in 2001 as the then Prime Minister and made significant contributions to the friendships between our two countries as a good friend of Japan. It is him who established the cornerstone of Japan-India relations today. Terming Vajpayee as an eminent leader of India, a added, I pray from the bottom of my heart that his soul may rest in peace. Besides, Japan, the US, Russia, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka, Nepal, Pakistan, Afghanistan and several countries can hold the demise of former Prime Minister Adil Bihari Vajpayee. Vajpayee, one of India's most charismatic leaders, who led the nation through several crises while holding together a tenuous coalition with his inclusive politics and superlative oratory, died here today at the age of 93. The American Embassy in Delhi said in a statement that the U.S. grieves with India on the loss of the former Prime Minister. He will be remembered for his immense contribution in bolstering U.S.-India relations. During his tenure, Prime Minister Vajpayee advocated for a robust partnership with the United States, referring to us as natural allies, it said. The U.S. mission in India extends its deepest condolences to the family of Vajpayee and the citizens of India, it said. Ambassador of Russia to India Nikolai Kudashev said, We mourn the death of Mr. Adil Bihari Vajpayee, a great statesman. Vajpayee's name became an integral part of a whole era in Indian politics, the envoy said. His devoted service to the nation can hardly be overestimated. Mr. Vajpayee enjoyed due respect in India and globally. We knew him also as a poet, a man of knowledge and a true friend of our country, where he is well known as one of the architects of our long-lasting and time-tested privilege strategic partnership, Kudashev said. Japanese envoy to India Kenji Hiramitsu said, I am deeply saddened by the passing away of former Prime Minister and Bharat Ratna Shri Adil Bihari Vajpayee. Hailing Vajpayee as one of the most inspiring world leaders, the envoy said the upswing in India-Japan relations was only possible by the initiative started by the former Indian Prime Minister. The demise of such a great leader is a great loss not only to India but also to Japan and other part of Asia as well as the entire international community, he said. Former Prime Minister Adil Bihari Vajpayee was cremated with full state honours at Rashtriya Smriti Slindeli on Friday evening.
tens of thousands of people, including top national and international leaders, joined the final procession and paid tributes. The three-time former Prime Minister and Bharat Ratna Award recipient died after prolonged illness on Thursday evening. The 93-year-old BDJP stalwart breathed his last at 505 p.m. at the All India Institute of Medical Sciences, AIMS, in the national capital. Prime Minister Narendra Modi, BDJP Chief Amit Shah and the entire Union Cabinet joined to take part in this final procession. Later. The tricolour that was wrapped around Vajpayee's body was removed and given to Grand Otter Niharika, after which the body was handed over to the family for last rites. Vajpayee's adopted daughter Namada Bhattacharya, accompanied with Niharika, performed the last rites. Namada lit the funeral pyre amidst the chanting, of Vedic hymns and firing of a 21-gun salute by soldiers. President Ramnath Kovind, PM Modi and Vice President Amvanka Inaidu led a galaxy of political leaders cutting across party lines to bid a tearful adieu to the former PM.